Welcome to Inspire Thinking. I'm back with book synopsis. How to win friends and influence people by Dale Carnegie. We have completed part 1 from this book and entering into the part 2 of this book. The part 2 is all about six ways to make people like you. Yes. And the first way, I mean the first chapter of part 2 is do this you will be welcome anywhere. Do this and you will be welcome anywhere. Yes. Dale Carnegie says, why to read this book to find out how to win friends? Why don't you use this technique which is being used by the greatest winner of friends? Entire world knows him. Who is he? You may meet him tomorrow while walking on the streets. If you are 10 feet away with him, he just wag his tail. If you are near to him, he jump on you and shows how much he loves you. Who is he? That is dog. Yes, Dale Carnegie talks about dog here. When he was five years old, his father got a yellow-haired puppy with 50 cents. And this small puppy name is Tippy. Dale Carnegie used to play with this Tippy daily afternoon around 4.30 pm. Dale Carnegie has a best wonderful companion with this Tippy for five years. After five years, this Tippy has dead in front of Dale Carnegie and Dale Carnegie out of tragedy. He just lost himself and this is the biggest tragedy in his childhood, I would say in his boyhood. Dale Carnegie used to tell these people that dog never read books. Dog never went to the psychologist to find out the psychology of human behavior. But still, dog knows very well. Dogs can make friends within two months. They can make more friends within two months, whereas people cannot make friends within two years. If at all they make friends, they cannot have belief and trust in themselves. Isn't it? Yes. Why dog can do it? The biggest secret is, the secret is, I mean, the principle of this chapter is become genuinely interested in other people. Become genuinely interested in other people, whereas dog did the same thing. And Dale Carnegie says, people are not interested in you and I, they are interested in themselves. In New York City, there is a telephone company who did a survey with 500 calls. They did a small survey to find out which is the most frequent word used by the people. And they have recorded 500 calls out of 500 calls around one word which is used by the people frequently around 3900 times. What is that word? I, 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 I. People are not interested in you and I, they are interested in themselves. Because people like themselves only. They want to listen about themselves only. So Dale Carnegie, further out of experience, he says, if we want to make more friends in our life, let's put ourselves out to do things for other people. The things require time, energy, and selfishness. And Dale Carnegie has worked years to find out the birthdays of his friends. He used to meet people. Whenever he used to meet people, he used to ask one question. Do you really believe date of birth has something, has anything to do with the character? And people used to give a reply, yes or no. Immediately he used to ask, what is your date of birth? And for example, if they say it's 24 November, he used to murmur 24 November, 24th November, 24 November. He used to write on a small chit. Once he goes away, he used to write on a small chit and put in the pocket. Once he goes back to his home, he used to transfer this 24 November date of birth date to his birthday calendar, his birthday book. And every month, beginning of the month, he used to know how many birthdays this month. He used to write in his diary and he used to send telegrams to his friends. And this is a big hit to Dale Carnegie in those days. And people are used to think Dale Carnegie is only one person on the earth who knows, who remembers each and everyone's date of birth. And he used to wish with the telegram. And he used to have a lot of friends. People can do anything for him. At that time, it, is a, it was a big hit. Dale Carnegie has a great time at that time. 
people just used to think Dale Carnegie is only one person on the earth who remembers date of births of ourselves. This is all about. Do this, you will be welcome anywhere. And the principle of this chapter is become genuinely interested in other people. Become genuinely interested in other people. Until then, Lakshmi Gant signing out. We'll meet again. Stay tuned.